My name is Ernie Cantu, and I've done a video here a while back, and I'm going to do another one. This time I'm going to make uh, do one on mink coil, mostly for work boots. And I'm going to show you the easy way to do it and the right way. And it's going to, what it does, if, if you get anything on the, any kind of liquid, it repels right off. They'll look nice. They won't be shiny, but they'll look nice. So I'm going to start right now and show you what I'm going to do. The first thing we'll do is just like a shine, we'll clean them up real nice. We'll clean them with solid soap and make sure we get everything off of them. Because work boots, they got all kinds of stuff on them. And we'll make sure that it's real clean. And then we'll wipe them off. Wipe them off really good. And then we'll get the excess off with the toothbrush. Make sure everything's off. And now you see that they look cleaner. Now we do the same thing with the other one. We'll clean it real good. The main thing is to take all the dirt off so that way the mink oil will work. Because if you just get a rag and wipe it around, all you're doing is pushing the dirt around. So right now, they look pretty good. Okay. Now I'm gonna put the Mink on. This is it right here. Okay, I usually put it on with a dabber or with my hand. Today I'm going to use a dabber just to get all the little spots in that, that are hard to do. Make sure you get enough of it. And you just do the bottoms and tops. Really don't need them because you'll get it on your pants and all that. Don't get me wrong, you can do it. You can put some in the top too, but most of the time, it's just the bottoms. That's what really gets dirty. And after you put a good coat on, Then we brush it. Get all the little ridges. Make sure it goes in good. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is kind of smooth it out with my hand. Just a little bit so it'll be even. You guys at home can do it too. And it's easy. And this is the right way to do it. There'll probably be somebody else out there that says that it's not, but I've been doing this a long time. Okay, we're smoothing it real good. Now we want to make sure it's going to work good, so brush it. Brush it real good. Okay, it's, it's on pretty good, so you really don't need a second coat. This will be fine. Now just get, this is a tricky part. 
A lot of people don't know this, but you want to seal the mink oil. So what you do is get a little bit of water on your hands. Go over it. Just go over it. What it does, it seals the mink oil. So the dirt won't stick to it. Because mink oil is a little greasy. And this way, And that's, that's about the finish part right there. We'll do the same with this one. Okay, what I usually do is put a little dressing on the bottom of the sole just so it seals it too. So we'll do that. This is the dressing. And it's also brown. Okay. This I do at the last on this. And what I do is wipe it off real good so you won't track it on the floor. But it really seals, seals the sole good. Okay, this is the finished product. And I thank you for watching my video. And I'll probably be doing some more. Thank you very much. How was it? Good.